Hello and welcome to tutorial for you channel. In this video I will show you how to fix packet burst. So let's get started. The first and the most easy solution is to check the servers to see if there is any ongoing issue with the servers. If that is the issue then you have to wait till it's fixed. If that's not the issue you can move to other methods to fix this error. Also check this game requirements to see if your system meets the specification. Check your internet connection and you can also visit to this website. This website tells you your internet speed. You can also open command prompt as an administrator and run the following commands. These commands are used to manage network connectivity issue by clearing DNS sketches, releasing and renewing IP address configuration and resetting network protocols. So open the window search bar and type control panel click on control panel and then select network and internet from there click on network and sharing center then click on this and then select properties from this box select internet protocol version 4 and click on properties again check the box that says use the following dns server address and enter the following DNS server address. Finally, click on OK to save the changes. First, find whatever launcher you are using. Just right click on it and select properties from the menu. After that, this window will open. Select the compatibility tab and check this box that says run this program as an administrator and then click on apply and ok then try running the game again if it's still not loading try reinstalling the game open the search bar and type windows defender firewall then open it go to advanced settings in the left side bar click on inbound rules then click on new rule in the right side bar select port and click next choose tcp and enter the specific port provided in the video description. Just copy and paste it from there. Then choose allow the connection and click next. Provide a name for the rule to easily manage it and then click finish. Then you have to repeat the process for the UDP port also. Choose UDP in the rule type. Enter the UDP port number from the description. Choose allow the connection, name the rule and then click finish. In the Windows Defender Firewall with the advanced setting windows, verify that a new rule appears in the inbound rule list. Now repeat the same process for the outbound rule as well. After that, restart your computer for the changes to take place. By adding specific TCP and UDP ports in outbound and inbound rules, you can optimize your connection for smoother gaming experience. If this video helped you, please give this video a like and if you want to support the channel, hit the subscribe button. That's it for this video. I will see you in the next video. Until then, take care. Have a nice day.